you threatened to expose some information about Offset involving some of the drama with Cardi B. Who? You. Oh, I kept the exposure from happening. You know, I got phone calls from people outside of Offset. You got to remember, I got relationships with people before my relationships with Offset. So I, I got a Cardi called me her damn self. Okay. Because you had put up a post. You said, uh, at Offset, little weird ass N-word, I told you keep my keep me out your emotional shit. It's your fault. You don't know the difference between a castle and a shack. What, what does that mean? Cardi B, Krishan Rock. Okay. You're lucky I respect sis, or I'd get out the way and really let the exposure happen. Remember what you said. Yeah, he's blaming me for what Blueface is doing. I didn't agree with Blueface for what he did. What did Blueface do? Well, he he posted, I don't know if it was text messages, pictures, I don't know what it was, right? Of Offset and Rock, Rashawn, fucking around, right? I wake up to it. I guess it's on Twitter somewhere. I don't be on Twitter, I don't know. My phone's going crazy, right? It's offset. He's telling me, telling me, only thing I'm hearing is blue face, blue face. I call blue face, hey man, what the fuck is going on? He's flipping out, tripping out. And I'm like, what did you do? And he said, I woke him offset to the circus. I said, well, what, what is that? And that's when he told me, um, he put up some text messages showing that whatever night French Montana had his party out there, I guess they hooked up, right? Chris Sean Rock hooked up with Offset. Exactly, right. And I'm telling Blueface, Nev, you can't. That's like, that ain't bro code. He said, I don't give a fuck. He want to be part of the circus, he part of the circus, right? Because in my head, I'm like, She's moved on. She didn't did this, 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 or that. So at the time this happened, y'all not even together, right? So you keep going back to wherever it's working. So Offset's calling me because in his head, I can stop it. But I can't stop nothing I don't know, know about, right? Blueface is pissed off. He's on his mission. He like, he want to be part of the circus. I'm going to let his ass join the circus. So now, you know, I'm learning other things, right? So I'm, I'm all ready to fight with Blueface to, like, try to at least control this fire. Like, yo, don't, don't do nothing else, right? Offset's thinking, there's no way he going to do that without you. Bro, I don't know nothing about none of this, right? And that's when he kept on accusing me. I'm like, I can really get out the way and let him go. And he can post all kind of shit, right? Don't mix me up and your decision making. Don't mix me in that. Now you called me, I called him. I didn't got into an argument with my artist to protect you. Somebody he feels has disrespected him. But in my mind, good old rock. <laughs> <laughs> it's the nucleus to the bullshit. Good old rock. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's the nucleus to the bullshit, right? But he's like, nah, uh, um, he wouldn't have did it if you wouldn't have green lit it. Bro, I didn't know nothing about none of this, but I'm telling him, like, if you want me to, I could just remove myself and let him go, which I was about to do that until I got another call. And out of respect to that call, I stayed in there and contained it because... And the call from Cardi B at that yeah, point? Yeah, yeah. Huh, okay. I guess I'm just wondering why any sane man, especially a married, famous, rich man, would mess with Chris Sean Rock. So I'm telling nephew, like, look, out of respect of Cardi, because I don't want no backlash going to her because she's telling me I don't got nothing to do with none of this shit. Like, he's single, I'm single, right? Just leave it alone. Brother, she get, she came in and helped your career. For real. You know what I mean? The Tatiana song, the video, everything she did for us. So out of respect to her, she ain't got she ain't got nothing to do with this shit. 
is anything she's feeling what you feel if we got to put her somewhere, right? And, you know, uh, I, I, I didn't understand it, but that's what made me understand that Blueface is really in love with this woman. Well, and they got a baby you know together. Saying? So me, I'd have been like, off with the bitch head. I'm gone. I, I'd have saw that. I'm really out of there. You really, you don't even mean nothing. I don't, I don't even, I don't even hear your voice. You can't even cry. I don't hear you. But he, you know, he, he, he in love with that woman. That's just what it is. Man, all I want her to do is sit in front of that damn flag and just gossip about Krishan, bro. I do not believe this one bit that Offset smashed Krishan. That shit crazy. And back when it first happened, Offset, he responded to Blueface. Because Blueface said, being tatted on the hoe is not a flex. You literally F Carter B husband a couple weeks ago. I'm tired of you niggas looking at me while they effing you. Get the rest of them going ASAP, please. And then Offset responded to him and said, I ain't never talk or touch that lady. Real talk, man. You need some help. So Offset, he already responded to this shit last year. I think it was like December or some shit. Because it was rumors that Krishan and Offset, they was together at some party somewhere and they was all up on each other and then he went back and smashed Krishan. And somehow Blueface found out and had proof and he was gonna leak it on the internet to prove that Offset did smash Krishan. Then Wack 100 jumped into it and said, nah, you can't do that. Cardi B helped you get your career popping. You can't be trying to expose some shit that's gonna hurt her. Like, whole bunch of mess. I do not believe it. And just like Wack 100 said, if it was true, if Krishan did smash Offset, why you wanna take her back for her? But I guess he look at Krishan like the money ticket, so he's like, he really don't care about her emotionally. He want her physically and financially, that's it. So even if this was true, like Blueface, he still would keep Krishan by his side just to make sure that money keep coming in because in his eyes, he put her on. So anything she do now, it doesn't go to him. That's how he feel, but this whole Offset Cardi B and Krishan, like this shit is crazy. This don't make no damn sense. And why the hell, like I said, two grown men on a podcast gossiping about some shit like that happened last year sometime. Six plus months ago. It's like the thing with Wack 100. He always want to be in the middle of something. He always want to take credit for something. Like, nigga, just manage Blueface, bro. You over here talking about if Krishan smashed Offset and you had to stop it and all this other shit, but with no proof. One thing about Vlad and Wack 100, they're going to gossip about Krishan. That shit is funny at this point, man. What y'all think about this, boy?